Today, in countless towns and cities across this great country of ours, we pause and honor the service of more than 46 million veterans who have served our nation. Here we are today at the National Training Center out here at Fort Irwin, California, where we're training soldiers and sailors and airmen, Marines, special operators across all our services to be ready for the crucible of ground combat. And for 241 years, America's veterans have brought liberty and hope to countless people around the world and built the foundation of the country that we all have the privilege of living in today. Veterans. Veterans are among our greatest teachers and doctors and lawyers and policemen and firefighters. They're our mothers, our fathers, our brothers and sisters, and our sons and our daughters. Our veterans are interwoven into the very fabric of our entire society. So on this day, Veterans Day, as we remember those who have served, I urge you to take a few minutes, just take a few moments, just think about and reflect on the freedom that we all have today because of their service and sacrifice each and every day. So our nation is stronger. Thanks to those soldiers behind me. Thanks to the training that goes on here at the NTC. Thanks to all the soldiers, sailors, airmen, and Marines who have served our country for two and a half centuries. Our nation is stronger thanks to them. Army strong.